Hi guys, welcome back to our YouTube channel. So in this video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to fix error 0x00001338 in Modern Warfare 3. Now, I am going to show you a couple of ways on how to fix that error. The first one is to restart your game, verify your game files, update your drivers, check the COD MW3 trailer board, and then reinstall your game. So restarting your game, this classic advice should always be your go-to before launching into more complicated troubleshooting methods. It's a quick and easy software refresh, but that also means it's less likely to fix anything substantial. So in any case, try this first on the off chance that it works. So next one is to verify your game files. The 0x00001338 crash pop-up actually advises you to do this the next time you start the game, to verify the integrity of your game files and ensure there aren't corrupted files bugging down your system, do the following. Okay, so go to your game library on Steam and right-click Modern Warfare 3. From the tab, Town menu, select Properties, select the installed files and click Verify Integrity of Game Files, then wait as the program reviews the files. Next is to update your drivers. Outdated drivers might be impacting your game which event happens when new releases arrive on the scene. So to check if you're running the latest drivers, head to AMD drivers in support and then NVIDIA drivers. Next is to check the COD MW3 trailer board. Sledgehammer Games is wrecking known issues in MW3, which you can see on the official trailer board. It splits issues into multiplayer, zombies, global, and resolve issues at the time of writing. The error code is 0x00001338 and is sent on the board yet. So I highly recommend reaching out to Activision Support's website and the official Activision Support X account to bring this to their attention. Now the last one is to reinstall your game. If all else fails, you might need to reinstall MW3 to give yourself a fresh start. If something went wrong during the original install, this would fix the problem. So I generally avoid doing this unless I've exhausted all other options. So if the error code persists, it could be a hardware issue. So you'll want to double check the system requirements for the game and also verify that your system is fully updated. However, if your PC is up to date and your files are clean, then it's more likely that Sledgehammer Games is responsible for patching in a fix. And that's it. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel for more video tutorials in the future. Bye!